Hello and welcome. I want to share with you how to use Excel's basic data form. We will not rely on any formulas or write VBA code to create the form. Everything we need is packaged in Excel ready to go. Suppose you have a data arranged so that Excel can recognize it as a table. In other words, you have a contiguous data with headers. Make sure your active cell is in the range or table you want to turn into a form. Then press Alt plus D key combination on your keyboard, followed by the letter O. There you have it, a data form. Let's try it again if you did not get the key combinations. Click a cell in the data range to make it active. Press Alt and D key simultaneously and then press the letter O. You can use the next and previous buttons to scroll through your record. To add a new record, click the new button and type in the new record. Realize that there is no text box for the total price. This is because the form recognizes that on the worksheet, that cell is supposed to have a formula to automatically calculate the total values. So you don't need to supply any value here. Press the Enter key or click New button again, and you should have the record added. If you think you may have some difficulties remembering those keyboard shortcuts we use to access the form, there is a form button we can show as part of our ribbon or quick access toolbar so that we can click instead of using a keyboard shortcut. Let me show you how to get the form icon if it's not already on your quick access toolbar. Right click on any area of the quick access toolbar and choose Customize Quick Access Toolbar. When the Excel Options dialog box appears, make sure to show all commands. Scroll through to find the form. Then click the Add arrow and then click OK. The form icon should be part of your Quick Access Toolbar. Now, make sure your active cell is in the range or table you want to turn into a form. Click on the form icon on your Quick Access Toolbar. Congratulations, you can now create basic forms in Excel. Thanks for watching.